great marketing is your truth shared. It's something that you need to ingrain and bring into the business consistently. Doing the work, that's what you need for success. to you about brochures and it's an interesting thing to talk about because normally I don't advocate them at all because too often in the past your default position after you got your logo done and after you got your website or maybe even before you got your website you reckoned you had to have a brochure because that's what was always done but I always question this I always wonder are you sure you're doing it for the right reasons because it's I'm always worried about making strategic marketing decisions based on what was done before. It should never be based on the decision of what was done in the past because we're creating a new future. And in the age that we're in, which is a digital age, and we're so used to getting things digitally, I do ask the question of the need for the brochure because it often dates and dates very quickly. But I, at the same time, I also like the idea and I a quick nod to Martin Neumeyer here which is when they zig you zag so if everybody else isn't sending brochures then it's time to consider it but once you consider it it's because it makes sense as a connection point to your customer and the reason I bring this up today is in the mail I love getting stuff in the mail in the mail I got a parcel okay just a simple envelope and it came from one of the people on the Get Strategic Get Results program and this is a shout out to Quarryfield and Michael Doherty, whose business it is. He sent me this, okay? And I know you probably can't see it because it's embossed, but this is an example of a choice that was made for a brochure that was something special. Because what Quarryfield does is something special. It's horse breeders. And Michael wanted to do something special to show what they did, to tell a story. And so this is not a brochure. This is volume one of a story. And I love that he took that approach. This is a unique approach to doing brochures and sharing people the story. And so when you get it, it's very beautifully done in a really unusual size, but it's also white and it's embossed with the name and the brand of Quarryfield. And underneath it, you can just see volume one. He wanted to do something special because he wanted to story tell. And I really like that he did that. And let me read for you a piece on the inside of the brochure because it's a way of doing it differently. So, it's all about the mayor is how he starts it. And there's a beautiful picture of a mayor and the harness on the head of the mayor, which I know I'm calling it incorrectly, but let me read for you. Each new mare in the life of a breeder takes you on a different path and brings new learnings. They introduce you to new approaches, new people and new markets. The birth of a foal creates great suspense and instantly opens up a new world of possibilities. In an industry where stallion brochures are abundant, I felt it was time for a brochure dedicated solely to mares, the mares of Quarryfield. Without mares, there are no breeders. These mares do so much for us as breeders, and therefore I feel it's fitting to profile them in this manner. Sincerely, Michael Doherty. And he goes on to share these beautiful images in this beautiful book of the names of these amazing horses, these amazing mares that help you understand the work of Quarryfield. And if you were somebody who is interesting in buying from a breeder, I think you'd be interested in this brochure. And this is a wonderful way of tackling that whole area of datedness, because this is volume one, which means there's more of the story to tell. So how can you look at your printed materials differently in a way that tells a story that has meaning, that has humanity, that can connect with who you're trying to reach 
and tells it in a way that will tug at their heartstrings. And yes, ultimately we want it to tug at the purse strings too. But it tells a story that can build a brand. That's what I want you to think about today. Thank you for your time. And thank you, Michael, for sharing this wonderful book with us. Have a great day. And if you want to see more and hear more from me and how great marketing works, subscribe by hitting on the red button just in the bottom right hand corner. Have a great day. You're unstoppable. You're unstoppable. No, they can stop you if they try. If you liked this video, hit the like button below and share it with your friends. And be sure to subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.